All right, home. Welcome to Scoring Fantasy Gundam Battle Alliance video. Now, this one is going to be talking about the grunt suits we have seen in SD Gundam Battle Alliance. So, I'm gonna go down the list. It's gonna be probably pretty quick, but we're just gonna go down. So, of course, the Jin from Scene. I want the Rocket version in the game, please. Uh, the GNX3 again. I want it as a playable mobile suit. It looks absolutely cool, and it would be cool to give Patrick some spotlight. The Adhede, again, uh, this one is a mobile suit that is introduced in Season 2 of Double O, and as we've seen most of the mobile suits from Double O Season 2, of course, this is probably going to be playable as well. The Zaku 2, we've seen it before. We know the whole entire moveset, actually, which is kind of cool, and they gave it to us in the demo. The Zaku Tank, again, was shootable down in the demo. Uh, not too much else to talk about. I mean, it can spin, so that's cool. Uh, the Zaku Cannon, again, stands, has a gigantic cannon, doesn't have a beam rifle, but, I mean, it has a cannon on the side, so that's adorable. Uh, the Virgo, of course, uh, I have a picture of it on the screen, uh, showcasing that was going to be playing with the game. And, of course, in the trailer that we saw for the Shinaju, the Virgo was shown in-game. And, of course, we have the Grays from I Am Blooded Orphans. I almost completely forgot about this while recording. Final mobile suit is, of course, the Leo. And the Leo has its space variant showcased in the game as long. And also, you get to pummel on it in the demo. Shorter video, but again, these are all the uh, grunt suits so far that have been showcased in the Sega Battle Alliance. If you have seen any others, please leave them down in the comments. I'm bound to have missed some. So again, if you enjoyed this video, you can of course leave a like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye bye